explanations of why electrolysis occurs. Okay, why electrolysis occurs when there is a current flow through? Eh? Okay, first of all, okay, and electrolytes are ionic, eh? so there are a lot of positive and negative ions in an electrolyte. They are composed of positively and negatively charged ions. So inside an electrolyte, there are positive, negative charged ions. When this electricity passes through this electrolyte, okay, on passing an electric current through the electrolyte, these ions move towards the opposite, oppositely charged uh, electrode. The negative ions, uh, the negative ions in uh, the this electrolyte will move to the positive electrodes, and the positive ions will go to the negative electrodes, uh, because we know that uh, opposite charge they will attract, and uh, same charge they will repel. So therefore, the negative ion go to the positive electrode, and the positive ion go to the negative electrode. Uh. So during electrolysis, the negatively charged ion move toward the positive electrodes. Okay, so this is negative ion. This is a positive electrode, and the negative ion lose their electrons to the anode, which is positively charged. So when the negative ions go to the positive electrode, eh, so they will release their electron. They give their electrons to the anode. Okay, actually it's the anode that uh, attract their electrons. Eh? Okay, this A node is connected to the cell, eh, the positive terminal, so it has a potential difference. Eh? So it will attract the electrons from the negative ions. The electron is then moved to the cathode through the external circuit. So after this uh, positive terminal attract the electrons, eh? so these electrons will be sent by the batteries, eh? will be sent to the cathodes. So these electrons, it will move. Eh? It will move, move, and move. Huh? It's moved by the batteries. Huh? Okay, it's moved by the batteries. The battery is act as a pump that pump all these electrons huh? from the positive terminus to the negative terminus. So now the negative terminus has a lot of electrons. Huh? Okay, so electrons is released by the negative ion and then move to the cathodes. Huh? And uh, what happens in the cathodes? So the positively charged ion move toward the negative electrode. So the positive ion will move to the cathode. So remember, the negative electrode contains a lot of electrons. Okay, the electron is from the positive electrodes. Okay, because a lot of electrons uh, have been pumped by the batteries to go to the cathodes. So there's a lot of electron here, and the positive ions will receive the electrons. So at cathode, positive ions gain electrons from the cathode, which has an excess of electrons and therefore an overall negative charge. So that's what happens during electrolysis. So finally, uh, this process results in a chemical decomposition of the electrolytes. So these electrons loses uh, electrons. Uh, sorry, these negative ions loses electron. Eh? Then it will becomes uh, a new substance here. Okay, a new substance. For example, so if this is chloride, so the chloride after loses electrons, then it will become chlorine, re uh, releasing electrons. Uh. So chloride become chlorine, uh. and uh, if the positive ions here, these positive ions are sodium ions. So this sodium ion receive electron, then it become a sodium metal, so a sodium element. So these two elements will decompose around the cathodes and anodes. Uh. So that is uh, what happens during electrolysis. Okay. It also allows electrons to travel from the cathode to the anode and hence allows uh, conductions of electricity. Okay. So it forms a new substance around cathode anodes and, and at the same time it conducts electricity. Yeah? So that's what happens. When electricity passes through this uh, electrolyte, then uh, chemical reactions occurs. Chemical reactions occurs, the negative ions okay, form a new substance yeah? okay. and the positive ions form another new substance. Uh, sodium ion and sodium are different. Eh? You, can, you need to know this. They are very different. Okay. Chloride ion and chlorine is also very different. Eh? They are two different substances. So that is uh, electrolysis. Eh?